Okay, we're ready to try video card 11. This is a 1977 cartridge for the Fairchild Channel F system. Video card 11 is a backgammon game, and there's also a variation of backgammon called AC Ducey, which just starts all your pieces in the home position instead of the traditional backgammon setup. Here on the back of the cartridge, you can see a pretty good example of that. In backgammon, you have the preset locations for starting point. In AC Ducey, you have all of them starting in the home position. But let's jump right in there. Game one is backgammon. Game two is AC Ducey. We're just going to take a look at backgammon because AC Ducey is pretty much the same thing. So what you do first is you roll your dice for a um, a starting roll. There we go. You hold it and then you let go. Ah, 16. So then the computer, or actually, it's a two-player game only. So the other player rolls. The one with the highest roll goes first. Hey, look at that. Sixes. Do we tie? Oh, it's a, is it a combo? Okay. Finally, so so I take my sixes as my opening roll. And you have to select a piece that's going to move six. And you see how slow my little cursor selector thing is moving. Yep, that's exactly what the problem is with this game. If you were sitting there with the board game, it would go so much faster. But you cursor over, and then you pick... So you pick one that goes six spaces. Let's take this other one and go six again. And then I can drop down. At least you can go up and down. But left and right is very slow, so let's do six with this guy. No, you can't do six. That's right. You have to land here, and you have to wait for him to leave there. So we can also do six with this one, for example. Uh, there we go. Sometimes the buttons stick for a little bit. Okay. But there you go. So you play a whole game of backgammon this way. And I just... I take one look at this here. The other player has to roll and so on and so forth. I just take one look at this and go, this would take so much longer to do it on the computer with these slow controls than just on the game board. So why even bother? And if you go and select game two, you'll see it's the same thing except the setup is different. You both start at home position. Roll, roll, so, so red will go first, aha, uh -huh. and so forth. Anyway, go get a backgammon game board and play it on there. They're just trying to put everything on a computer at the time, so give them kudos for that, but um, yeah, but just not really worth playing.